A Long Island lighthouse, which is on the National Register of Historic Places, could be lost forever. Preservation is warned that decades of de decay could doom the 150-year-old signal tower. As CBS 2's Carolyn Gussoff shows us tonight, this restoration work, it's on hold because of cost concerns. A mile off King's Point, a beacon visible from the Throgs Neck Bridge, the 150-year-old Stepping Stones Lighthouse is functional but crumbling. Think of what people went through to build this lighthouse, 1876, lit in 1877, and today they can't even do the most minuscule of work. To, to preserve it. For Long Islanders who cherish its 20 lighthouses, it's hard to watch this one's demise. It's a, it's a crime. Certainly when we look back at some of the lighthouses that have been lost, um, you think, well, what were they thinking? And while the debate goes on and we try and figure a way to fix it, Nature just keeps eating away. A debate over who should pay for its restoration. It was supposed to be a public private partnership. The price tag more than $4 million. Private money was raised, but the public part lagged. The town of North Hempstead agreed to be its steward 14 years ago. They locked it up one day and walked off and said that they were not going to be doing anything with it. Demolition by neglect, and that's where we're watching that happen now. We're all in agreement. The lighthouse was neglected by the prior two administrations. The current town supervisor says she paused further work until a current assessment of the cost. Nobody knows what the expense would be, so I, you know, I can't comment on spending taxpayer money on something. We have no idea what it would be. It would frankly, be writing a blank check. That assessment was underway Thursday with an encouraging prognosis. By and large, it's still in remarkably great condition. Salvageable. Absolutely. But should it be done? Lighthouses are indicative of the economic and social development and political development of, of a nation. An opportunity to actually stand where people did over 100 years ago, where children were raised and actually went to school by boat. Nonprofits say they can raise money if the town shows progress. And we're stalled right now. And we got to get started again. If nothing is done, the lighthouse would still have to be replaced. It's needed for navigation, but with a steel tower and an automated light. They say a lost lighthouse is lost history. On Long Island Sound, Carolyn Gussoff, CBS 2 News. The Great Neck Historical Society is also asking for federal and state grant money for that restoration.